What is up, you guys? It's Valetele here, and welcome back to Let's Catch a Vibe. Now, I hope everyone's feeling grateful, amazing, feeling vibey. As you guys can see, I am continuing to do the item shop switchover. As you guys can see, last night we had the return of the brand. Sorry, return of the brand new. We had the return of the Immortal Sands bundle. Really, really cool bundle. It's cheaper for me because I already own um, literally three items at this at the bundle. So pretty much, um, I end up getting away with a thousand V books off. But really, really cool skins. Definitely recommend grabbing these. I would definitely recommend grabbing my. Is it, or is it watching my? Is it or grabbing it? <laughs> I wish you could grab the video. Uh, is it or is it not worth it? Bond of video um, on the Immortal Sands. Some really, really cool skins here, especially if you are of like, um, you know, like. Well, I don't want to offend anyone when I say this. You know, they like. Oh, what am I thinking? You know, like Arabian Nights, that kind of like you know Indian culture stuff, like you know flying carpets stuff like that. Anyway, really, really cool. Moving us on to the return of the second half of the featured store, we have the return of some basketball favourites. So, starting us off, we have the Traversal um, Icon Series Airplane emote, and the crowd goes wild. First introduced last season. I believe this is one that was vaulted on as well. Moving us on to the return of the male skin, we have the Jump Shot. Vertical Victory, part of the half-court set, first introduced in OG Season 4. Moving us on to the return of the Triple Threat, it's all about the fundamentals. Part of the half court set, first introduced at the same time as the um, jump shot skin. Funny enough, they've literally just announced a is it NBA two? Is it NBA um, twenty three? I don't know the names. I always change the names. But anyway, I think they've just announced a Michael Jordan edition. I was like, what? Mind you, it might be like a fiftieth year or something. It might be like a special year for him, um, like an anniversary for him. But yeah, shout out to Michael Jordan, one of the best players in all of basketball. I don't care what anyone says, it's just the same as in football. Ronaldinho was the greatest player that ever lived. Anyway, moving us on um, to a bit of sports knowledge. Moving us on to the turn of the slam dunk harvesting tool. It's a slam dunk, part of the half court set. And yes, if you ever wanted to hit somebody with the backboard or the actual, um, <laughs> the actual hoop itself, now you can. Moving us on to the turn of the hang time glider. Get Air, part of the half court set. Jeez. This is music you guys remember from an emote. Moving us on to the turn of the ballsy emote. Keep your eye on the ball. Quario. Jeez. Wait for it. How many balls are there? One, two, or three? <laughs> Let me know in the comments down below. Anyway, moving us on to the daily store. As you guys can see, we've got some really, really cool skins in here. I haven't seen the Moxie skin come back in a while. Anyway, we've got the Moxie skin. Put up your Dukes. Part of the TKO set. First introduced in the OG Season X. Really, really cool looking skin. I might actually pull this out the lot, out the, out the vault, actually. Really, really cool looking skin. Love the spikes on the um, gloves and on the right shoulder pad. Really, really cool. Again, we've got two styles. We've got like a blue and teal. And then we've got a like black red. Yeah, black and red. Anyway, moving us on to the bat bling, we have the moose. Fight like a moose. Pretty cool. Again, two styles. We've got the default, which has got like, I want to say sparkly gloves. And then we've got the red gloves for the um, alternate. Anyway, moving us on to the return of the recon ranger. Expert field intel ranger. Again, really, really OG skin from the OG season 10. Love that um, pink um, like body armor she's got in the middle. Always love that. Anyway, moving us on to the emotes, and we have a harvest and tool. Moving us on, we have the cheer up emote. Be aggressive. Be aggressive. First in season OG season 7. Jeez, quite a Moving us on to the return of the golden hoe. I mean, <coughs> golden digger. Anyway, the golden standard. Part of the fatal fielder set. First introduced in the OG season 7. OG season 8, sorry. Who the hell am I talking about? <laughs> Oh my god, it's like what time in the morning I'm recording this. Anyway, moving us on to the traversal full tilt emote, or as I like to call it, the Naruto run. Lean into it. First introduction of OG Season X, looking pretty damn badass. Moving us on to the return of the Icon Series Dance Monkey emote. A slow, shy shimmy for the battlefield. First introduced two seasons ago now. As you guys can see, last night we had the return of a quest pack, but this is a brand new quest pack. This is the Phantasms Level Up quest pack. Now, you guys know we usually get these towards like the halfway point of the season. 
pretty much to catch, catch you guys up if you guys aren't um, leveling up as quick as you would like. But anyway, starting us off, we have the Phantasm level up pack. Starting us off, we've got the Phantasm himself. A spectral echo in search of his next physical form. Part of the elemental Eudelon e set. Anyway, really, really cool skin. Definitely giving me like teen angst vibes. Um, like I'm expecting him to drop a hot verse on a beatbox. Or I'm expecting him to do like some breakdancing. But anyway, nevertheless, it's a really, really cool skin. Love the eyes. Oh, love the black and red eyes there. But anyway, really, really cool skin. We have the Phantasm. Now, moving us into the styles, which you guys will unlock through doing the challenges. We have the hat off version. Again, really, really cool. Love that tattoo above his eye as well. And the last one, at least, we have the Cyborg version. <laughs> Jeez. Now, I did see this in the in-game um, files, but man. Oh, is he supposed to have hair coming out of his um, helmet there? I don't know. But anyway, really, really cool skin. Again, giving us that like, dark vibe. So pretty much, um, the Phantasm includes the purchase of the Phantasm Level Up Quest Pack. The Cyborg style unlocks upon completing all 28 quests. So if you guys remember, um, pretty much these are the tokens that you level up tokens that you go on them. You descend on the map and pretty much pick them, pick them up and they'll level you up. Um, but yeah, available uh, within four weeks. Quest drop um, September 8th. Um, so yeah, you've pretty much got quite a while to do it. But yeah, moving us on to the challenges. Again, four sets of weekly challenges that contain seven tokens. Each one will give you one level up. Moving us on to the back bling, we have the Beyond Portal. A delicate slash made in the fabric between realms. Jeez. What's mad as well, this reminds me of a scene from Sandman. I'm not going to say anything about it, but if you guys have seen Sandman and you've seen the last episode, you'll know where I'm going with that reference. Anyway, we have the Beyond Portal. Now, this does have a selectable style as well, so it is um, a floating back bling. So we've got the Beyond Portal, and then we've got the Ruby Reverend. I mean, look at that. That just, oh my god. That is just cold. You can't tell me that's not cold. Jeez. Anyway, to be fair, you could use this one on the Naruto skins. Yeah, you could use this in one of the Naruto skins. Anyway, moving us away from that, we have the animated wrap, which again looks absolutely badass. As you guys can see, we got like some flare from the eyes, and the eyes glow as well. Really, really cool wrap. Definitely recommend, uh, definitely recommend grabbing this, guys. I'm going to be grabbing it for sure, even though I'm like almost 200 now. But I just want it because I want it. Anyway, moving us to the harvesting tool, we have the all-seeing scythe. Capable of perceiving the spectral realm. Again, same style as we had with the bat bling. We've got the default. And then we've got the ruby revenant. Oh, this is so cold. It's unbelievable. 1,200 V-Bucks. Do I think it's worth it? A hundred percent. Especially if you guys have been struggling um, leveling up. But see now we've had the Dragon Ball Z challenges now. Um, and most of the challenges for this chapter have been quite easy. You guys should be leveling up. Uh, but anyway, if you are falling behind, you have the Phantasm level up quest pack. 100% recommend grabbing this. I am going to be doing it easy or easy, not worth it, bond of video after this item shop. So stay tuned for that. Moving us on to the return of the Dragon Ball Z section of the item shop. We have Goku and Beerus, Vegeta and Bulma, and then the Dragon Ball gear bundle. Really, really cool. Definitely come grabbing these guys. I'm going to be jumping on later and doing the... Um, I forgot what the challenges are for today. Anyway, really, really cool. Definitely recommend grabbing some of these items. But guys, that was the item shop from last night. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. It might be a bit short and sweet because I didn't go that in-depth on the Immortal Sands bundle. But anyway, it's a really, really cool bundle. I would definitely recommend grabbing it. I say that like I already don't own some of the items. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to smash the like button. If you did enjoy the video, let me know in the comments down below why you didn't like the video. Also, let me know what is your favourite item from the item shop. Is it a skin from the Immortal Sands bundle? Is it an item from the Daily Store? Is it, or is it the brand new Level Up Phantasm Quest Pack? So... Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you're new and join Team Let's Catch a Vibe. Also, if you are new, please don't forget to push on the bell notifications to get notified as soon as upload. But more importantly, don't forget to stay vibey and I'll catch you all in the Shadow Realm. Peace.